everyone, my name is Sam Selders and I'm an internet marketer here at WebFX. We all know that online content is extremely important, but sometimes it's hard to determine how long each piece of content should be for the best results. Let's talk a little bit more about the kinds of content you can create and how long each should be. First, let's talk about informative articles. Informative articles probably take up the bulk of your website. They're the pages that give users information about your products, services, strategies, or your company as a whole, although there are really no limitations in terms of topics. Informational articles are sometimes also referred to as article pages, and they're usually between 1,500 and 2,000 words. Content pages with this high of a word count are also referred to as long-form articles, and they are proven to rank higher in search engine results pages. The average length of the top 10 results in SERPs or search engine results pages was around 2,000 words. In fact, the average number one ranked page had 2,416 words. That being said, if you want your article pages to rank highly in search engine results pages, you should aim to write at least 2,000 words, even though that might be a little more lengthy than what you're used to writing. Blog posts are great pieces of content to add to your website because they act as quick and timely updates to your website. Blog posts are also easily shareable on social media and in your email marketing campaigns. You can use blogs to give your opinion on something or to spur conversation with your potential and current customers. Just like informational articles, it has been proven that the longer your blog posts, the better. You should aim to write at least a thousand words to ensure that your blogs rank highly in search engine result pages. Typically, blogs aren't made to be as lengthy as long form because readers are looking for a quick read. They usually aren't looking for an expansive discussion, though some blogs can definitely be longer than a thousand words. 10x content is designed to be 10 times better than any other content written on that subject. The topics that you cover with 10x content should be subjects that you can talk at length about and it should entirely inform readers about that subject. Instead of just using text, you should also include images, videos, mini graphics, and other multimedia to keep the page from feeling like a long block of text. That being said, this is the longest kind of content. 10x articles are at least 2,500 words, so you can cover all the details of your subject and fully explain your visual elements. Case studies are great ways to draw customers to your website because they're real life accounts of how your services affect your customers. It's hard to determine exactly how long a case study should be, but it should always tell the whole story. But when you show potential customers the full scope of your services, they will see the quality of your work and the commitment you have for your customers. Videos are another kind of content that can help draw users to your site and keep them there. Topics for videos can range from a tour of your facility to a how-to video using one of your products. No matter what the content, you should always keep your videos fairly short for easy viewing. In a study done by Wistia, it's proven that the shorter the video, the more likely it is for users to watch it from start to finish. Videos that range from 10 to 20 minutes in length will only be watched 50% of the time, whereas videos that are a minute or shorter will be watched 75% of the time. Since search engine ranking is so important, you should do everything you can to get your content on the first page, and with these guidelines, you're ready to go. Do you have any other content types that rank highly in Google? If you do, let us know in the comments below, and thanks for watching.